Good evening. My name is Michelle Schwartz. I'm the principal at DeForest Area High School. I'd like to welcome everyone to the 2020 Senior Awards Night. It is my pleasure to honor our seniors tonight for the hard work and dedication that they've shown over the past four years. Although we cannot be all together in person, I want you all to know how proud of you our DeForest Area High School staff is. I would also like to thank the donors of our scholarships. Many of these scholarships from our community have very special meaning and we appreciate your support of our students. Additionally, I'd like to congratulate and thank all of the parents for your support and encouragement that you've given to your sons and daughters. And finally, congratulations to the members of the class of 2020 who will be honored here tonight. Good evening, my name is Eric Renez and I proudly serve as the superintendent of the DeForest Area School District. I'll be presenting a number of scholarships this evening. The first is the Wisconsin Academic Excellence Scholarship. It's a renewable $2,250 scholarship and it's awarded to Adam Horton, Brennan O'Brien, and Elliot Pickard. Congratulations. The next scholarship is the Wisconsin Technical Excellence Scholarship, also a renewable $2,250 scholarship, and it's awarded to Paige Beerkirch Anich, Maren Grothaus, and Sean O'Brien. Congratulations. The next award that I'm pleased to announce is the National Merit Scholarship Program Commended Student. Congratulations to Brennan O'Brien. And the final uh, recognition that I'm pleased to announce is the National Merit Scholarship Program Finals. I'm pleased to say that we have four finalists, which is quite an accomplishment for the class of 2020. And our four finalists representing uh, DeForest Area High School are Adam Horton, Elliot Pickard, Taryn Shuka, and Noah Wohler. Congratulations to those four. Good evening, my name is Rhonda Gilbertson from DMB Community Bank. On behalf of DMB, we would like to congratulate all graduating seniors. I'm here tonight to present three $1,000 scholarships. Congratulations to Zachary Elf, Maxwell Bashel, and our youth apprentice, Riley Schwartz. Congratulations to all graduating seniors. Hi, I'm Ellen Sexton and I am a 1992 graduate of DeForest High School. I set up the Ellen Sexton Community Service Award for the student that emulates the best community service for now and in the future. The amount of the award is $3,000 and this year's awardee is Chloe Bernards. Congratulations, Chloe. You wrote a great essay and congratulations to all the 2020 grads. Cliff Roberts, Grand Knight, Knights of Columbus of, at St. Olaf's Council 6460. We give away six scholarships a year at $750 each. This year we have five from the forest and one from Wanakee. The winners from the forest are Corey Trabatowski, Leah Miller, Leah Doucette, Lane Larson,
and Andale Conway. Good evening. My name is Stephanie Hayroth Wilcox, and I'm here on behalf of my family, including my dad, Dave Hayroth, and sister Renee, to present the Lisa Hayroth Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500. We established this scholarship 16 years ago after my mom, Lisa Hayroth, who was the longtime school secretary at Windsor Elementary School, was killed in a car accident. We knew there was no better way to honor her memory than to establish a scholarship in her name that is for a young woman who participated in either volleyball, basketball, or softball during her high school career, and who is dedicated to academic excellence, to serving her community through volunteer work, and to participating in extracurricular activities, including those outside of athletics. Therefore, it is with great pleasure that we present the 2020 Lisa Hayroth Memorial Scholarship to Megan Mickelson. Hi, this is Jerry Holmes with the DeForest Gridiron Club. Uh, it's that time of year again to honor four athletes with Gridiron Scholarships. And this year's scholarship recipients are Cole um, Yoakum, Trey Schrader, Lane Larson, and Taylor Van Oyen. Good luck to all you guys in the future. Thank you. Hello, I'm Vicki Subcheck. This is Mr. Data helping me out. I'm the Vice President of the DeForest Lions Club. The motto of Lions Club around the world is we serve, and for that reason we select students who have done great work serving others. On behalf of the DeForest Lions Club, I'm honored to present our three $1,000 scholarships to the following seniors who have served their school and their community. Cecile Fox, Adelaide Conaway, and Emily Bonoano. Congratulations. Hi, my name is Matt Bauer. I'm one of the assistant principals here at DeForest Area High School. It is my privilege to announce two recipients of the Dwight and Bonnie Ziegler Scholarship. Each recipient will be receiving $500. Congratulations, Leah Miller and Seth Williams. I have several Northern State University scholarships to announce. They are Northern State University's Dean Scholarship in the amount of $1,000 renewable, a Northern State University Swimming Scholarship in the amount of $600, and the Northern State University Wolf Pact Scholarship, which is a $2,000 renewable scholarship. Congratulations, Mackenzie Matson. It is my privilege to announce the recipient of the University of Chicago Odyssey Scholarship in the amount of $70,653. Congratulations, Sarah Martin. Hi, I'm Sue Paulson, and I'm privileged to be able to award the William and Susan Paulson Scholarship in the sum of $1,000 each to six deserving seniors as follows. Riley Schwartz, Alyssa Laufenberg, Chloe Bernards, Isabel Burke, Adelaide Conaway, and Benjamin Jacquard. Congratulations to all of you and wish we could meet in person. Go Norskis. Hi, I'm Dr. Michael Bolley. I have Baki Chiropractic Clinic here in DeForest, and I'm here to present this year's Baki Scholarship Award. 
Um, the Bakke Scholarship has been going on since 1995 in order to help support educational opportunities in healthcare. Um, this year, we would like to present our $500 scholarship to Maddie Ebel. So congratulations, Maddie, from all of the doctors and staff here at the DeForest location. And we would also like to say congratulations to the rest of the 2020 class. Hi, I'm Mr. Resser, and I'm here to present the Woodrow Dutch Stalder Scholarship. It's a $500 scholarship, and this year that goes to soccer star Leah Doucette. Congratulations, Leah! I'm here to present the UW Stout Promising Student Scholarship. It's a $1,000 renewable scholarship, and this year that goes to Augusto de Freitas. Congratulations, Augusto! I'm here to present the UW Stout Chancellor's Scholarship. It's a $3,000 renewable scholarship, and this year that goes to Zachary Alp. Congratulations, Zachary! I'm here to present the Bemidji State Achievement Scholarship. It's a $1,250 scholarship, and this year that goes to Lane Larson. Congratulations, Lane. Hello, and congratulations to the DeForest Area High School Class of 2020. My name is Tony Hedberg, and I'm the president of the DeForest Area Sports Boosters. Every year we give four outstanding student athletes a $500 scholarship to go to the college of their choice. This year's recipients are Logan Bierman, Brooke Burr, Amanda Fitzgerald, and Taylor Van Oyen. Congratulations and good luck in all your future endeavors. Hello, I'm Andy Lovick, the Vice President of Norsky Soccer Club, and I am pleased to announce that our $500 Dave Phillips Scholarship is going to Annika Grothaus this year. Congratulations, Annika. Hello, everybody. My name is Tom August. I teach history at DeForest High School, and I also have the pleasure of being student council advisor and senior class advisor. I have a variety of scholarships to hand out today. The first one, from Cardinal Stretch University, Franciscan Scholarship Academic Scholarship, $16,000 renewable, goes to Sidney Hoffman. Also from Cardinal Stretch University, the Volleyball Scholarship, $8,000 renewable, goes to Sidney Hoffman. From Edgewood College, my alma mater, the Cor Ed Cor Award. Cor Ed Cor is Latin for heart to heart. $1,000 goes to Casey Conkle. Also from Edgewood College, Founders Scholarship, $13,000 renewable, goes to Casey Conkle. And from Edgewood College, Visit Award, $500 goes to Casey Conkle. From University of Wisconsin La Crosse, First Scholars Program Scholarship, $2,000 renewable, goes to Genesee Hammeister. Also from UW La Crosse, Residence Life Scholar, $1,750, Genesee Hammeister. And UW Lacrosse Scholarship, $1,600, goes to Genesee Hammeister. The last set of scholarships I'm pleased to announce goes to four individuals that have been on student council for the last four years. This is the student council scholarship. It is for $750. And the four award winners are Chloe Bernards, Adelaide Conaway, 
Casey Conkle, and Lexus Staple. Thank you very much. Congratulations to all. Hi, my name is Lisa Wink and I'm the president of the DeForest Area Music Boosters. This year we are proud to award two scholarships to our graduating seniors. Our first scholarship is a Mark Seeger Scholarship in the amount of $250. This scholarship is awarded to Marcus Schnell. Our second scholarship this year is the Paula Paris Choral Scholarship in the amount of $250. This scholarship is awarded to Daria Ellickson. Hi, my name is Kim Banigan. I'm the Learning Information Systems Coordinator for DeForest Area School District. I'm proud to present two scholarships this, this evening on behalf of our district's leadership. That group includes principals, assistant principals, directors, our superintendent, and others. Our first scholarship recognizes a senior going into K-12 education. This individual has also shown leadership within the school and within our community. We're proud to present this $500 scholarship to Chloe Bernards. Our second scholarship recognizes a senior who has demonstrated varied and impactful leadership in the high school and within the community. They have a strong history of service within DASD and within the greater DeForest community. We're proud to present this scholarship for $500 to Benjamin Jacquard. Hello, I'm Kathy Diaz Phillips, and I'm representing the Wisconsin Association of School Business Officials. This year I'm presenting the Waswell 2020 Presidential Scholarship, which is a $3,000 scholarship co-sponsored by Waswell and United Healthcare. This year's recipient is Mariana Laura. Congratulations. Hello, my name is Hogan Huey, and I'm here tonight to honor two students with a $500 scholarship, Ferris Martin and Madeline McMahon. This is the Wayne Huey Annual Scholarship, and this is to help students go to college that have been affected by cancer and have still persevered to go on to college and to better their futures. I wish both of you the best of luck. Thank you. Hi, my name is Chris Miklos. I'm here to present the 2020 Clayton Underdahl Lacrosse Scholarship in the amount of $500. And the winner is Natalie Scaife. Congratulations, Natalie. Warm greetings to the DeForest Area High School graduating class of 2020. I am Richard Snorton, the commander of the American Legion here in DeForest. It is with great honor that I am here to present the Olson Grindy O'Donnell Post 348 Scholarship Award for 2020. This year's recipient is Adam White. Congratulations, Adam. Best of luck to you and all your fellow classmates in your future endeavors. Thank you. Hello, I am Connie Skelton and I am a proud member of the DeForest American Legion Post 348. We are a service organization dedicated to our military men and women, both past and present. We are honored each year to offer a scholarship in the amount of $500. This year, our scholarship goes to Ferris Martin. Ferris will attend UW Platteville and major in engineering in the fall. He also is enrolled in the Wisconsin Air National Guard. Good luck, Ferris. We are proud of you. DeForest American Legion Auxiliary Post 348 
is also pleased to offer a scholarship in the amount of $200 in memory of one of our members who has passed this year. The Sharon Wilson Memorial Scholarship will go to Adam Zapiniak. Adam will attend Madison College in the fall, and he is also enrolled in the Wisconsin Air National Guard. Good luck, Adam. We're proud of you. Hi, my name is Anthony Johnson, Colleen Kolash and I, as co-advisors of the National Honor Society, and on behalf of the American Red Cross, would like to present Adelaide Conaway, Casey Miners, and Natalie Scaife with a scholarship for $833 each in recognition of all of their amazing work this year. Awesome job, you three. Hi, my name is Andrea Kalla, and I'm the school psychologist at DeForest Area High School. It's my pleasure to announce the two recipients of the DeForest Area Support Staff Scholarship, valued at $500. They are Isaac Love Jackson and Taylor Schumper. Congratulations. It's my pleasure to announce the two recipients of the Don and Belinda Myers Scholarship, each for the amount of $500. They are Madeline Ebel and Natalie Mack. Congratulations. It's my pleasure to announce the recipient of the Northern Illinois University Northern Academic Scholarship. $4,000 renewable. She is Daria Ellickson. Congratulations, Daria. It's my pleasure to announce the two recipients of the Dragon Arts Group Scholarship, each for $300. They are Daria Ellickson and Taryn Shuka. Congratulations. It's my pleasure to announce two scholarships from the University of Minnesota. The first one is the National Merit University of Minnesota Scholarship in the amount of $1,000 renewable. The second is the University of Minnesota Gold Scholar Award in the amount of $5,000. The recipient of both of these scholarships is Taryn Shuka. Congratulations, Taryn. Hello. I'm Beth Faust and I will be announcing the winners of the Kurt Faust Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500 each. The Kurt Faust Memorial Scholarship was started to encourage and support students that participate in sports at DeForest High School. Applicants are asked to express what they have learned from sports and how that will help them with challenges in college. This year there were 12 applicants and 12 excellent essays. The CF Memorial Scholarships are awarded in memory of my husband, Kurt, who passed away in 2015. Kurt grew up in DeForest and was a Norski true and true. He played three sports throughout high school, and in the summers, he played Legion Ball and home talent. Kurt attended Madison College, where he played basketball and baseball. He coached our two boys in youth sports, varsity baseball at DHS, and also supported many basketball and football teams over the years. Kurt had a gift of humor and was able to encourage and uplift the young and old. As the class of 2020 goes out to meet new and unknown challenges, look for ways to encourage and inspire those around you. Out of extraordinary times comes extraordinary people. This class, the graduating class of 2020, can transform these uncharted times into innovation that will strengthen the world. This year, we had the most applicants apply for the CF Memorial Scholarship. Thank you to all that applied. It was very difficult to pick the winners from all the amazing essays, but I'm happy to announce the two winners of the 2020 Kurt Faust Memorial Scholarships are Ms. Taylor Schumper and Mr. Tanner Ingeset. Congratulations! <laughs> I am confident you will both continue to succeed with everything you do. Before closing, I want to thank the community businesses, organizations, and individuals that have supported our annual golf outing. 
the annual CF Golf Outing here at Lake Windsor Country Club is the sole fundraiser that supports the Kurt Faust Memorial Scholarship Fund. Without donations to this event and all the golfers, we would not be able to support these young people as they go on to college. Thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Take care and stay well. Hi everyone, I'm Chris Dorsey, the youngest of nine Dorseys who all graduated from DeForest High School, class of 83 for me. In 2016, we established a scholarship in honor of my sister, Catherine Dorsey Tatusco, who passed away of breast cancer at age 61. She was class of 73. She was an amazing person. She had degrees in journalism and nursing and had a master's in social work, was a Fulbright scholar, even served in the Army Reserves but her life was about service, whether it was to people or the Lord. She had a great sense of humor, had a beautiful smile, and had an infectious laugh. She married a terrific fellow by the name of Wayne Tatusco, who some of you probably met last year when he presented this award. And together they lived in Northern Virginia, just outside of Washington. Kathy was strong in her faith, and she believed all of us had a responsibility to be a part of the solution in government. Kathy largely died because of a failure of our medical system. And before she passed away, she was able to pass legislation in the state of Virginia, state of Virginia, so other women didn't have to go through what she did. That's the kind of person she was. She was an extraordinary life force. She was, in a word, exceptional, which is why we think she would be delighted with the selection of Angie Vang for this year's scholarship. Angie, we've heard many wonderful things about you. And on behalf of Wayne Tatusco, her husband, and the entire Dorsey family, want to wish you all the best. And to the class of 2020, get out there and make a difference. Hello, my name is Chris Smith, the DeForest Future Business Leaders of America advisor. And today I would like to announce the winners of the DAHS FBLA scholarship. The winners are as follows. Elliot Pickert, $400. Natalie Scaife, $400. Riley Schwartz, $200. Adam Horton, $200. And Kyle Dolak, $200. Congratulations to our members and good luck in your future. And today I would like to announce the winners of the following scholarships. First, the Fred Chase Memorial Scholarship. Congratulations to Adam Zapiniak for receiving $1,000 and Elliot Pickert for receiving $500. Next, the University of Wisconsin-Madison College of Engineering Dorothy Marshall Frawley Scholarship. Congratulations to Elliot Pickert for receiving $1,000. Finally, the University of Wisconsin-Madison Kemper K. Knapp Scholarship. Congratulations to Elliot Pickert for receiving $7,500. Hi, everybody. On behalf of the National Honor Society, uh, in conjunction with Mr. Johnson, my co-advisor, we would love to give the National Honor Society scholarships to our two presidents this year, Madeline Ebel and Eliza Esser. Thank you for all the work that you've done for NHS this year. We're so proud of you. Good evening. My name is Debbie Brewster, and I represent the DeForest Area Rotary Club. This evening, we have two scholarships to award. One is for $700 to Madeline McMahon, and the other is $300 to Caden Welter. Congratulations.
I have the privilege of presenting an award to a senior who has been working on a scholarship for seven years. This senior was chosen in fifth grade for the DeForest Area Business and Education Partnerships 512 Scholarship. Each year, she met the criteria, earning additional funds for her scholarship. Thank you to the following local businesses who have been supporting this scholarship program for several years. Essential Family Vision Care, DMB Community Bank, Paulson Development, and Dr. Meredith Bakke. Tonight, I am proud to present Cassandra Wendt with a $1,000 scholarship. Congratulations. I would like to now award the DeForest Times Tribune Scholarship, which is in memory of Earl N. Emerson in the amount of $500 to Annika Grothaus. Congratulations. My name is Gretchen McLean. I'm an English teacher here at DeForest High School. I have four scholarships to give out. The first two are one from Columbia County 4-H Comstock Scholarship. This is for $500. And the second, the Columbia County Sale of Champions Scholarship for $300. Both go to Cassandra Wendt. Congratulations, Cassie. The next scholarship is for the National Merit University of Texas at Dallas Scholarship. It is a full tuition scholarship plus $11,000. This goes to Noah Wohler. And finally, the Token Creek Lions Club Scholarship is, three, is for $500 and it goes to Chloe Bernards. Congratulations. Hi, my name is John Webster. I'm the DEC advisor for DeForest High School, and we have a scholarship that we are awarding to Kendra Walton this year. It's a $500 scholarship for her great leadership in DECA, on the DECA leadership team for the last two years. So congrat congratulations, Kendra. My name is Carrie Drotting, and I am a school counselor at the DeForest Area High School. Brigham Young University would like to award a scholarship for $5,970 to Alexa Staples. The University of Illinois at Chicago Merit Tuition Award Scholarship for $8,408 is being awarded to Benjamin Raminger. Also going to Benjamin Raminger from the University of Illinois at Chicago Swimming and Diving Renewable Scholarship for $12,000. University of Wisconsin Chancellor Scholarship from UW-Whitewater Renewable for $2,000 is being awarded to Henry Rohde. University of Wisconsin Superior AD Wheaton Scholarship for $500 is being awarded to Evan Ritt. Hi, I'm Kate Boyce, English teacher at DeForest High School, and I'm reading the next set of scholarships. The Herb Cole Initiative Scholarship for $10,000 goes to Brandon Vang. The Madison College Softball Scholarship for $1,800 renewable goes to Taylor Von Barron. The UW-Milwaukee Lubar School of Business Scholarship for $86,000 goes to Shane Van Domlin. The UW-Milwaukee Scholarship for $500 goes to Shane Van Domlin. Congratulations. Hi, my name is Doug Crowley and I'm one of the assistant principals here at DeForest Area High School. It's my pleasure to announce the recipient of the University of Florida Benequisto Scholarship valued at $18,930 renewable. That recipient is Adam Horton. Congratulations, Adam.
and it's my pleasure to announce the recipient of the National Merit Scholarship in the amount of $2,500. Congratulations, Adam Horton. It's my pleasure to announce the two Brew Family Scholarships, each in the amount of $750. The recipients are Adam Horton and Taryn Shuka. Congratulations to you both. It's my pleasure to announce the Victor E. Albright Scholarship in the amount of $100 to Alyssa Laufenberg. Congratulations, Alyssa. It's my pleasure to announce two scholarships from Michigan Technological University. The first one is the Scholars of Excellence Award in the amount of $12,500 renewable. The second is the Volleyball Scholarship in the amount of $87,000. The recipient of both of these scholarships is Casey Miners. Congratulations, Casey. Hello, my name is Mike McHugh, Athletic Director at DeForest High School. Congratulations to the class of 2020. I'm here to present some athletic awards. The first is the Wisconsin Football Coaches Hall of Fame Scholarship in the amount of $1,000, and that goes to Cole Yoakum. Cole, congratulations. The second award is the WIAA Spirit of Sport Award. Adam Zapiniak was chosen to be our statewide recipient and then was also a national finalist for this award. Adam, we are super proud of you. We're really proud of everything that you've overcome and the role model that you became for us, and we wish you nothing but the best in the future. We have eight individuals who are three sport athletes for all four years of high school. This is a tremendous accomplishment, especially at a school of our level. Those individuals are Sydney Hahn, Alyssa Laufenberg, Samantha Schaefer, Taylor Schumper, Alex Endress, Evan Ridd, Cody Kukar, and Trey Schrader. Our coaching staff thanks you for your efforts, and we're very proud of you. And we know that what you've learned through the time commitment, time management, and dedication that you've provided for us for four years will help you definitely in your futures. Thank you, guys. The last award is the WIAA Scholar Athlete Award. This is one of the most prestigious awards that a student athlete can receive. Our female recipient is Alyssa Laufenberg. Alyssa maintained a 4.0 GPA while earning nine letters in cross country, basketball, track and field. And our male athlete is Trey Schrader. Trey maintained a 3.6 GPA while earning 11 letters in football, basketball, and baseball. Trey will leave DeForest High School as one of the most decorated athletes in school history. Congratulations to all of our award winners. And from the DeForest High School Athletic Department, we wish you nothing but the best in the future. Go Narskis! Hi, I'm Sarah Ensign. I'm one of the counselors at the high school. I have the pleasure of awarding several um, scholarships uh, to members of this graduating class this year. Uh, first of all, I have the honor of awarding the Kathy Butler Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $500. Kathy Butler was a colleague of mine when I started at DeForest High School. I learned a lot from her. Um, she was really devoted to her career and students, and so it's really a pleasure for me to be able to award um, the scholarship in her name to Michaela Beckman. I have the honor of awarding the Arizona State University Provost Distinction Award in the amount of $13,500 renewable. The winner of this award is Eliza Esser. Next, I have the honor of awarding three scholarships sponsored by the Windsor Family Dental Clinic. 
Um, these scholarships are in the, each in the amount of $500, and the recipients this year are Eliza Esser, Madeline Bartels, and Sydney Hahn. Next, I have the Wisconsin Delta Educators Scholarship. Um, this award is in the amount of $2,000 and intended to go to a student planning to pursue a career in education. This year's recipient is Chloe Bernards. Finally, I have the honor of awarding the Tom Nicholson Memorial Scholarship. Tom Nicholson was an assistant principal at DeForest High School when I started my career here. He was a wonderful person and a just very devoted educator. It's really, truly my honor to be able to award um, his scholarship in his name this year in the amount of $500 to Samantha Schaefer. Hi, my name is Chris Miklos. I'm one of the high school counselors. The first award I'm presenting tonight is a Heather Ray Anderson Memorial Scholarship. Heather Ray Anderson was a 1992 graduate from DeForest Area High School. In 1993, at the age of 19, Heather passed away from a blood clot caused by a softball injury, the sport she loved so much. Soon after her passing, family and friends formed a softball tournament in her name, the HRA Tournament, for scholarships at DeForest Area High School. On behalf of Heather and her family, congratulations goes to the winners of the Heather Ray Anderson Memorial Scholarship in the amount of $2,000 to Logan Bierman, Taylor Schumper, and Lane Larson. My next award is the Evco Legacy Scholarship in the amount of $500. The two recipients for this award are Sarah Martin, Brennan O'Brien, Brennan is also receiving the next scholarship I'm presenting, which is the Godsean Family Scholarship in the amount of $2,500. The next recipients for this award are Madeline McMahon, Michaela Beckman, and Elliot Pickard. Congratulations to all award winners. Taylor Von Barron is receiving a $1,000 scholarship from the Dane County Promotion Committee. Hello, I'm Kristen Joyce and I'm representing the DeForest Area High School Science Department in presenting the Outstanding Science Student Award to two students for $50 each. The winners of these awards are Sydney Hahn and Benjamin Jacquard. Congratulations. This time, it is my pleasure to honor the 2020 Laude Scholars. The first group of scholars that I would like to recognize are Cum Laude Scholars. I will read their names in alphabetical order. Megan Ackerman, 
Sierra Alexander, Zachary Elf, Ashley Axford, Madeline Bartles, Lindsay Bergman, Logan Bierman, Aiden Clark, Amber Fabian, Amanda Fitzgerald, Giselle Garduño Nunez, Brandon Hunt, Lane Larson, Isaac Love Jackson, Isabel Manzetti, Ferris Martin, Connor Martinson, Michaela McFall, Casey Miners, Megan Mickelson, John Roth II, Maya Rotzel, Samantha Schaefer, Kayla Schlimgen, Zaren Schmitz, Marcus Schnell, Callie Scholes, Angie Vang, Jamie Vagley, Jaden Vong, Catherine Walkie, Whitney Weisensell, Kaylee Wheeler, Adam White, Grace Wild, and Paige Yoakum. Congratulations to our cum laude seniors class of 2020. The next group I'd like to introduce are magna cum laude scholars for the class of 2020. Kayla Bauman, Michaela Beckman, Isabel Bale, Chloe Bernards, Emily Bonanno, Benjamin Randall, Brooke Burr, Isabel Burke, Madeline Ebel, Daria Ellickson, Tanner Angasaf, Brady Feist, Cecile Fox, Marin Grothaus, Sydney Hahn, Genesee Hammeister, Rachel Hawley, Casey Conkle, Mackenzie Matson, Leah Miller, Emma Murray, Spencer Pabone, Chase Shortreed, Taryn Shuka, Natalie Scaife, Kira Stark, Cooper Steele, Adam Zapiniak, Taylor Von Baron, Kennedy Wallace, and Catherine Worthman. These are our magna cum laude scholars for the class of 2020. Congratulations. And finally, I'd like to introduce our summa cum laude scholars for the class of 2020. Maxwell Bashel, Adelaide Conaway, Bryn Dish, Leah Doucette, Eliza Esser, Conlon Gatsian, Annika Grothaus, Adam Horton, Benjamin Jacquard, Alyssa Laufenberg, Alyssa Leatherberry, Sarah Martin, Brennan O'Brien, Elliot Pickard, Henry Rohde, Benjamin Reminger, Alexis Staples, Kendra Walton, Seth Williams, Haley Willis, and Noah 
Wohler. These are our summa cum laude scholars for the class of 2020. Congratulations to all of our laude scholars. In closing, and on behalf of the staff, the school board, the administration, thank you to our family and friends for helping us celebrate this evening. A special thank you to the class of 2020. Thank you for your tremendous accomplishments, your contributions, your high achievement. It really has been remarkable. Seniors know your, your hard work and dedication has not gone unnoticed. Your teachers, the administration, the school board, your families, and the greater community are so very proud of you and all that you've done during your time here in the DeForest Area School District. Now, obviously we would have preferred that this would have been an in-person gathering, but I wanna thank all of you seniors because of, your, because of your hard work, you've given us something to celebrate. Something to celebrate during a time when there's really a lot of anxiety, a lot of unknown, a lot of troubled feelings around what's going on in our world right now. So thank you for giving us something to be proud of and to celebrate right now. And this class of 2020, your resilience has been impressive. Wherever life leads you from here, know your community takes tremendous pride in each and every one of you and your current accomplishments and what we expect to be future contributions that will make our world better. Most importantly, your school district community will always welcome you home. So tonight, seniors, congratulations on all of your wonderful accomplishments and everything that you've attained. We know that your future holds much for each and every one of you and we continue to be proud of you and we look forward to what the future holds. So again, thank you all for attending this evening and we wish you the best of luck.